Welcome to this guide on how to change A records in cPanel. Today, we'll walk you through the steps to manage the A record for your domain. If you want to switch your website hosting to a different provider, you'll need to update the A records from Host Africa's. If you're hosting your emails with us, be sure to follow the section where we update the mail.domain records too. Some of the common providers are Wix, Squarespace, Shopify, Weebly, Webflow, and so on. These providers allow you to point your domain to their servers by modifying the A record. These vendors will provide the necessary IP address as part of their setup process. Before we start, make sure that your domain's name servers point to our servers. Okay, let's start managing the A record. First, log into your cPanel account. If you're not sure about the login process, check out our guide linked in the description below. In cPanel, use the search bar and type Zone Editor to quickly find the option. Find the domain for which you want to change the A records. Then click on the Manage button next to it. Click on A under the Filter option. You'll see a list of current A records for your domain. If you're not sure what to change, it's a good idea to take a screenshot or make a note of the existing settings. Locate the domain with the A record and click on the Edit button. Copy the current IP address and save it for use in the next step. Enter the new IP address provided by the vendor and click on Save Record. Now let's update the records for mail.domain. This will be mail.whatever your domain is. Click on CNAME under the Filter option. On the mail.domain, in this example, we'll use mail.example.com, click on Edit. Then change the type to A. Now enter the saved IP address from the previous step and then hit Save Record. To change the MX record, click on MX from the filter options. Then click on the Edit button next to the domain and change the destination from domain name to mail.domain. In this example, we'll change example.com to mail.example.com. Don't forget to save the record. That's it. You've successfully updated your A record. You can always restore the DNS records to the default settings. To do that, click on the Action button, then select the Reset DNS Zone and Confirm. You have successfully reset the DNS zone for your domain. Remember, DNS changes might take 4 to 24 hours to propagate across the internet. If you found this tutorial helpful, hit the like and subscribe icons for more. Stay tuned for our next tutorial. Until then, happy hosting.